Hey everybody, it's Cora. Thanks for dropping in. I'm going to be going over my first Petunia Pickle Bottom Haul. And what I got is a pivot pack, a nimble clutch and changer, and a stroller hook. So let's go ahead and take a look. So the first item that I have here is a stroller hook. And this is my Oh My Heart. And this actually came as a gift with purchase when I purchased my items. And this actually looks really nice. It feels sturdy. It has like this non-skid grip to it. And it's a pretty color. I love the rose gold color onto this and this pink as well. Feels pretty sturdy there. And obviously it looks like it'll fit a lot of strollers or a shopping cart or whatnot. I'm pretty sure the handles won't be any bigger than this. <laughs> so this looks really pretty. I can't wait to try this out. They also had on the website a Mickey Mouse head shape silhouette just like this in the stroller hook with the same color. And they also had a couple different colors as well. So I thought that was cool. But this came for free when I bought my item. The next item I have here is a nimble clutch and changer. And this one's in Disney's Little Mermaid. And I thought the colors were really pretty with this. I'm not a huge fan of the Little Mermaid, but I couldn't say no to trying this out. And it's a clutch, has a handle right here and it has a velcro so you can attach that to a stroller or a bag and on the outside there is a zipper pocket and looks oh it feels feels lined like kind of like a waterproof lining to it and here is the zipper pulls kind of a leatherette leatherette um material here. It looks like uh, just like a regular yellow gold colored hardware. On the other side, you have the print here as well. And there is a handle. And then there are Velcro straps on the side. And ooh. so here is a pocket with that waterproof, not wa yeah, waterproof kind of material right there. And it just opens up like that. I'll go ahead and take a picture of it opened up a little bit better so you can get a better view of it. And then looks like here, oh, there is a spot for a wipes container, which it comes with one. Awesome. So it looks like this wipes container just kind of snaps. Open and close. It doesn't have a a uh, top part where you can open that up to pull out a wipe so i think you just have to open that up to pull out a wipe and you can just slide it in there or if you have your own wipes case obviously you can put it in there and then it has a change pad it's like a pretty st standard change pad it does have a little bit of a foam to it Ooh, and actually this part is actually much thicker than the rest I don't know if you can see the difference to that, but you can kind of feel on this side that it's more padded than the rest. Or maybe it's just me. It feels more padded than the rest of the change pad. But I think this would be pretty handy just to have all my diapers in one place and my change pad as well. You can just kind of grab it and go. So this style bag, is actually what I wanted to try on Petunia Pickle Bottom. I'm not much of a fan of Disney princesses, or I am actually, but I kind of wish they had more different kinds of princesses, including the classic princesses on here. As you can see, they have the white, um, they have the rose gold colored hardware. It's very shiny. And then they have Cinderella, Aurora, Tiana, Belle, Ariel, Snow White, Castles. And it has like a blush colored background. And they have the stars. And the bottom 
is a blush color as well. Um, more of a, like a mave blush color. And then they have kind of a plastic zipper teeth on here. And they have the zipper pulls, which is the, also the leatherette material. And this side has a expandable pocket with the elastic bands here. And then on the back side, which I actually found pretty interesting, is this whole thing. So it's a pivot pad. So you can go from backpack with the backpack straps here. They're not removable. And then from there, you can just kind of grab it on the top handle and it can be a shoulder tote. And then you have rose gold colored hardware here. And then this back here is a pocket. And it actually has, it's a gray interior and it's kind of felt lined and one thing i liked about this bag that i actually look at look for in a lot of bags is this thing right here kind of a it's a luggage strap so you can go ahead and put this over your rolling luggage handle and kind of have it attached to your rolling luggage. I'll go ahead and post a picture to show how that looks. I'm just curious to see of how that looks because you have these straps kind of in the way a little bit. But obviously they're straps so it can move to the side if needed. And then on this side, there is a zippered insulated pocket and these it was advertised as a bottle pocket so there is some insulation to there and here in the front also thought was interesting is this insulated pocket so it has a double zipper and it has insulation to this as well it doesn't it's not very wide the bag itself actually doesn't seem very wide. I'll go ahead and put the dimensions up on the screen off the website. And there's an insulated pocket here. It's a flat zippered pocket with a double zipper. And then this is cute. It has a little lobster claw there. So you can attach your hand sanitizers, your pretty bag charms, or your keys if you want it just hanging out there. That's pretty useful. And down here, I thought was really cool is another insulated zippered area. So when I first saw this on the website, I thought that was pretty interesting. I was like, oh, that's cool. I can go ahead and put like my daughter's bent go chill box in here, but I don't believe it'll fit. I am going to do a packing video on this later on and to show what I'll pack in this. Um, but just looking at it, it doesn't look like it'll fit. I kind of wish this was a bit wider to put, be able to put more um, like of a food container or whatnot so you can just have it in there. And now on top is a zipper area and it extends out and has a top opening. So it kind of allows you to open that a little bit more. So in here, actually, let me change the view of this. So you can see how it looks on top a bit better. So on top, you have a one long slip pocket and they're kind of like the length of the back of the bag. Then you have a big open area in here. This thing right here is where that bottle pocket is. So it extends inside of the bag itself. And then it does come with a change pad, which is nice to have. And that is actually a bigger change pad than the Nimble Clutch and Changer in width. And it already has, and it seems easier to fold because it's already kind of pre-lined. Also in here, you'll see a couple mesh pockets. These two black mesh pockets go all the way at the end, at the bottom of the bag. And then you also have a key leash with a lobster claw. 